Little Poncho Vanilla is a nice story, but there are definitely some stereotypes in this. This is a 1938 Warner Brothers cartoon. It's directed by Frank Tashlin and written by Ted Pierce. And this is about this little Mexican boy who wants to become a bullfighter. But he's just this little boy and nobody thinks he's going to be able to do it because he's, he's so small. And he decides that he has the determination to prove them wrong. Can he do it? I won't say any more, but as I've said, it's a lovely story about determination and self-belief. And there's also a strong message there about not judging people based on how they look and not putting people down or or, or telling them that their dreams are, are not worth anything because of their, their appearance or their stature. So the message I, I, I think was really beautiful. I think it was told in a way that was um, easy to follow. The character of this little Pancho Vanilla is, is very likeable. And I wanted the best for him and I hoped that things would go his way. Whether or not they do, of course, I'm not going to say, but I really liked him as a character. So as a story, it was really good and it's very, very well animated. However, it is worth mentioning that there are some stereotypes that are um, maybe not as good. Maybe not the worst there is, but it's just something that's worth bearing in mind that there is certainly room for some improvement with some of the... Um, some of the way the characters are presented but generally I really liked it I thought it was an enjoyable story with a really likable protagonist and I was really pleased to follow his journey I hoped for the best again I won't say whether or not he gets the best but I thought the message there was uh, was very sweet and very well presented definitely one that I think is worth checking out